Hi guys, welcome back to Naomi Ganja Fitness. So guys, this workout is a love handle or muffin top workout and this has 10 exercises. All the sets and the repetitions are given in the exercise. So he's the person who helps me <laughs> with all my camera work. Um, so I hope you enjoy this video. And also guys, if you do not know, I have a free monthly workout schedule for you all. So the link is in the description box below. Absolutely free. All you have to do is click on the link. When you click on the link, then the workout will be mobile or computer. Just be up, you can save it. And uh, free workout, yeah, I have a workout free. Mil hai. Please click on the link and I have a lot of workouts. Hai. And uh, follow karo and let me know uh, what are the results that you see. And I hope you enjoy today's love handle muffin top workouts for all the chubby chubby fat that we all have. Um, let's get this video to 5,000 likes. Guys, honestly, your likes, they keep me really motivated and they motivate me to experiment new workouts and see if they're really working and also to bring them to you all. So please uh, like, subscribe to this channel. I'll see you on Monday or Thursday, 7.30 p.m. So our first exercise is wind shield wipers. Lie on your back, T-shaped with your arms, your palms facing upwards, Pick your toes off the floor, knees bent 90 degree and legs parallel to the floor and twist your torso to the right and then to the other side. Keep your core tight. Windshield wipers activates core stabilizing muscles and targets the obliques and also the abdominal muscles. It's a very good exercise to reduce and tone or tighten the love handles or the muffin top or as we say side belly fat coming to the second exercise oblique twist crunch so we start in the wheel shield wiper position and then we crunch up using our obliques do this on one side and then move on to the other side and then crunch you have to have a mind and muscle connection with your oblique muscles as you are going to crunch or bring your body up using your oblique muscles. This will help target the side belly fat and the muffin tops or the love handles. This motion has to be slow and controlled. Our third exercise is heel touches. Lay down with your back on the ground and your knees bent and pointed towards the ceiling. With your arms on your side, raise your shoulder off the ground, crunch your hand to the foot and repeat the same on the other side. This is a slow and controlled movement. Our fourth exercise is side plank hold. This targets the obliques. Start on your side with your feet stacked on top of each other and your bottom forearm directly below your shoulder. The form is very important. Engage your core and raise your hips until your body is in a straight line from head to toe. Then you hold this position. The fifth exercise, we start with the side plank position and then we drop the hips towards the floor and raise them back to the starting position. The side plank hip dips fires up the obliques. Next, that is our sixth exercise, is the plank hip dip. Exercise number six is plank hip dips. Start with the low plank position again and rotate your hips to engage your core. Slow and controlled motion, this will engage your obliques, your abdominal muscles and also your lower back. Exercise number seven is Russian twists. Sit on the floor and bring your legs out straight and lean back into a V-like shape. Brace your abdominal walls to engage your core. Balance this position and twist your torso from side to side, keeping your legs in place. Do not disengage your core if you feel tired. Take a break and then come back again and only perform this exercise by engaging and keeping your core tight. Exercise number eight is Plank Spider-Man. Start in a low plank position with your body in a straight line, your elbows bent and under your shoulder with your feet hip width apart. Bring your right knee to the right elbow in a hopping motion. Repeat on the other side. This has to be a slow and controlled motion so that you can feel the crunch in your obliques. 
make sure you do not hurt your lower back while performing this exercise. Exercise number 9 is Squat Side Crunch. Place your hand by the side of your head, squat and while standing up, bend to your side to lower your elbows and simultaneously bringing up your knee and meet your elbows. Crunch your left oblique and then return to the starting position, squat again and then repeat on the other side. It is very important to establish a mind and muscle connection with your oblique muscles. Our last exercise is side twist hop. In this exercise, you have to hop from side to side, bringing your elbows to your knees and then repeat on the other side. This adds the much needed cardio in this routine for fat loss.